Hey everybody, it's Jordan Collier here with the Storybook Wealth Builder channel. And today I want to do something a little different, a little unscripted, uh, a little bit more raw commentary and to get a little bit more personal. Uh, I just wanted to open up my performance of my portfolio almost six months to, to the day when I first uh, got skin in the game and decided to go on this investing journey and start a YouTube channel. And I thought it would be a good idea as I've posted a bunch of videos and I figured, well, you know, it's a good idea to share this with the audience as, um, you know, if you are a subscriber or someone who's, who is thinking of subscribing to this channel is like, who behind the channel, how are they making their decision? What are their principles they're putting in place? Um, what are their practices and how do they go about choosing stocks? I mean, that all is going to be for a different video. I'm strictly just going to go over the performance of my portfolio and its nine positions in this video. I'm only going to do it by percentage and not by uh, dollar figure amount. Our relationship just isn't quite there yet. So uh, with further ado, let's go from the outhouse to the penthouse. Okay, coming in at the number nine position is Algonquin Power and Utilities at negative 0.59%. In the eight position is Alimentation Couchetard at 4.31%. In the number seven position is Capital Power Corporation at plus 4.34%. In the number six position is Enbridge Incorporated at plus 6.16%. In the number five position is Atco Limited at plus 10.17%. In the number four position is an ETF, XSP iShares Core S&P 500, which just tracks the S&P 500 index. Solid, solid ETF at plus 10.86%. In the number three position is Canadian Utilities at plus 12.42%. In the number two position is an ETF, ZEB BMO Equally Weighted Banks at plus 14.62%. And in the Penthouse position, my flagship stock, the first stock I ever bought is Suncor Energy at plus 73.16%. Anyways, everybody, if, uh, if you enjoyed that and um, you are curious about why I chose these stocks, um, my process of going about choosing stocks, how I weight them, um, formulas, benchmarks, uh, um, filters that I go through. Make your opinions in the comments below and I'll be more than happy to respond. Super smash all the buttons of the like and subscribe variety and hopefully you stick around for future videos. Until next time, thanks a lot.